Welcome back people to Dark Souls, prepared to die, and uh, last time we beat the gargoyles, and now we're actually going to head back in the general direction of that, because we need to unlock the shortcut to Violent Shrine, it's kind of an important uh, shortcut, so, uh, I wonder how many times we've done this now, just ran out here and killed these skeletons, or these hallows even, more times than I'd like to think. My god, you do this a lot in this game. These guys are just assholes. Like, they're not even any challenge. Right. So, this is the shortcut down to Pilot Shrine. To unlock it, all you gotta do is come and stand here and ride the elevator down. So that's easy. I think about it, we need to go back to Piling Shrine anyway, because to get to the lower undead burr, you don't really want to be at uh, the undead um, thingy chapel. Oh, actually, there's some items in Piling Shrine I totally forgot to go around and get. So up here, we've got just a soul. Uh, if we go over here and drop down here we can come out over here there's a ton of chests so um, let's just grab these cracked red eye orb I'm not entirely sure what they do never used them morning star and a talisman talisman's kind of important actually you might, you might use that hmm. six homeward bones very useful and in here, we've got some Lloyd's Talismans. Lloyd's Talismans are pretty pretty good as well. And these bloody skeletons. Come over here. Grab that. Oh god. Yeah, and those skeletons kill me pretty much. <laughs> skeletons are not a nice thing. Shit. Uh, now I've got to run all the way back there. Didn't really think about that. Oh, I need to get those souls as well. And I'm... Oh, that was really dumb. Why did I do that? I saw the item and was like, oh, I'm going to go get that item. Forgetting that skeletons are actually really tough when you first come across them. Uh, damn it. Oh, well, we don't have to kill these guys now. And just run past them. And run into the shortcut. See you later, shitlords. God, I'm ugly when I'm undead. Oh my gosh. Need some need some armor. Really need some armor. I really want to get my uh, my souls back. That's thirteen thousand souls. That's too much to lose. Right, let's talk to this guy quickly. Hello there. I believe we are not acquainted. I am Petrus of Thoroughland. Have you business with us? If not, I'd prefer to keep a distance, if possible. That guy is an asshole. We will kill him later on. Hello there. I realize that I have, but I also want you to hear. No, he gives us a copper coin. That doesn't do anything right now. Oh my! You were get Oh, I, I have to awake my companion. So what if I would would that? Yes, yes, that would please me. Very well. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'll join the covenant, I guess. Now let me only their ultimate effectiveness will be detected. Sure. Um, now, purchase item, let's see, you can get, can't get it, but actually buy any of them, can we, because we lost our bloody, God Come damn it, the if stupid skeletons, I can't remember if I can actually kill these skeletons or not, I guess I can, there's no, no necromancer around here, um, I won't go through here, you hear snoring here now, don't worry about that, it's not important. Right now, anyways. Okay. 
grab our souls and peg it. At least to die in a reasonable pace. But I think we can get to the shrine and everything will be good. I was really worried when I first heard that, but uh, don't be. It's fine. Nothing to be afraid of. Rest of the bonfire, reset the skeletons. Excellent, we've got levels to use. So, um... I think some more endurance would be nice. A bit more dex. How many souls do I have now? Is it 2,300 souls? Hmm. Okay, let's do that. And I want to keep a couple... Oh, actually, we've got 7,000 souls. Duh. Let's level up a few more times then. Um, hmm. Let's do that. Level 20. It's reasonable. Now, where are we going? We're going to the uh, Loranda Bird, aren't we? Obviously. Oh, shit. I killed the merchant, didn't I? Damn it. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. We will level up that extra point in vitality. I'm an idiot. <laughs> um, I just spent on souls as well. I can't go buy any miracles. Whatever, it doesn't matter. I'm not thinking all that straight. Stab this guy. These skeletons are so annoying. Screw that. I can't be able to go get that soul over there. We don't need to go get that until later. Anyway, well, we can get that later when uh, we have to go there. Out of my way. Did he drop? No, the blood stain. Damn it. Kill that rat. Didn't drop humanity. Okay. Ah, this long trek is actually a pretty long trek to get to the next part. If you want to go the safe way, anyways. Uh, easy as pie. Through here, up here. Nice that we can one shot these guys now. Right. Rest at this bonfire. And you want to head up here. Now, this is the risky way of doing it. Um, but it's okay because uh, you should be able to do this without dying. <laughs> and you'll also get like some souls for it. So that's excellent. Right. So, do that. Run down here, get hit, don't get hit. Get 555 souls. You can actually farm that bridge by going down to the bonfire. And now you want to run. Okay, wow. Well, didn't actually get hit a second time. That's nice. Right, so now you have the basement key and use it here. All right, this is right where the sun bro is over there. Uh, you could go around past the Taurus demon to get here, it's the safest way, but because that dragon can sometimes just burn uh, multiple times on the bridge and you can die, but I don't know, maybe they changed that. Slide down here. And you'll come out here. Now you want to go up these stairs first. 
because this will unlock a really useful shortcut. As you'll see, we have actually come out on the other side of that bridge with the fire bombers. So now we can go down through here. We can jump down here, not jump down there, but um, whatever. Right now, you want to come down here. You want to be really careful here because these. New mobs, these dogs, they cause bleed, and uh, they can do a lot of damage. In fact, everything down here causes bleed, pretty much. There's another dog, there's three of them, so just be aware of that fact. Oh, we really need a bow, actually. Like, hmm, not sure where I can get a bow, just a normal one. Right, residence key. Somebody, You'll need to use anybody, here. Help me. Damn, I'm fit powdered. So, residence key. Boom. This guy. Oh, we get armor here. Yes. You opened the door for me. Thank you. I am, this is Greg of Vinheim. He's uh, he's like the sorcerer trainer. Oh hello. I well, the basic decide. sorcerer trainer anyway. I'll do that. This thing will drop the full sorcerers. Yeah. I don't really want to use that armor because it's kind of crappy, but uh, we'll use in yeah, some. We'll get new armor in a second, anyways. Now these guys, you want to be real careful because how? Oh god, I've got all four of them. That's not good. You want to be super careful about these guys because they have the potential to hit really hard, and. Uh, they can kill you pretty pretty easily. There's another three of them here, oh my god. They also do fire damage as well, so uh, if you've got a 100% block shield, it will still do damage. Damn it. Kill those, yes. Excellent. Grab this, it's a twin humanities. Uh, kind of useful. Like, it's a full heal if you run out of Estus Blasks, so pretty pretty useful, and it also gives you two humanity, so you can kindle a bonfire off one of them, pretty useful. Now this is, is it this door? No. I think it might be this one. Damn. Okay, gonna have to, you wanna run out here, then run back because there's an ambush of these guys, they cause bleed because they're really nice like that. Oh, and they can do a weird backstabbing move that glitched out there. Ouch. Be careful. Stab them. Right, up here I believe is the male breaker, or yeah, it's a rapier, it's kind of crappy. Don't want to be using that. Is there anything in this room? No. Is there anything in this room? No. Right. This is one of the harder parts of this now. Gotta be really careful. If you can aggro, there's a dog down here. If you can aggro him before. Has he seen me? I hope he's seen me. Yeah, he has. Kill him. That makes this a whole lot easier. There's another ambush right here. If you got these three guys and the dog, you're gonna have a bad time. Ouch. Uh, no. You do want to watch out for that meter there, because that's a bleed meter. If they, if that gets to full, you'll ba you'll basically die. 
Like, there's not much coming back from that, especially if you're not at full health when it happens. Ouch, 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 ouch. That was risky. Alright, we've got five Estus Flasks. Now, I think we should be able to do the Cap Redeemer. Bandit's Knife. Hmm. Not particularly useful. Oh, Hello Thief's Legs. Don't know whether that's any better than what we're about to get, but um, where is the bonus oh, down here? All the way down here. There's another dog actually. Let's kill him first. Stab him in the face. Right. In here we'll have a full set of thief black leather. Really nice. Let's uh, throw some of that on. That was better. Hollow thief or? Black Thief is so much better. Uh, how much weight am I carrying? Yeah, I'm good. I think. Uh, I've got fatty roll now though. Hmm. Whatever. Stab this. Get a large soul of the undead. Is there anything in this one? No. Okay. Is there any more dogs? I can't remember. Right. The hardest part about this fight now is the start of it. So, right, let's, I'll show you what you kind of need to do. There's the Capra Demon, there's also dogs. I'm in a really bad spot right now. There's another dog there, oh my god. You need to run up here and get onto here. He will fall down. Let's gotta wait for the other dog. Because he can't get up here now. Did I kill both the dogs? Oh god. I don't know if I killed both the dogs. Alright, he's gonna come up here now. Be careful. It sometimes hit you. Right. Uh, shit, what am I going to do? I'm going to do this. This will make it easier. Now you want to jump down, do a falling attack. Oh, that dog's stuck. Huh. Interesting. Right, now you want to come up here. Ouch. Heal. Fall down. Kind of fortunate that the dog got stuck, but. Alright, he's gonna now. Shit, fuck. You want to sort of come halfway up the stairs and uh, wait for him to come round and then uh, then come over here. Okay, he's not doing what he should be. It could hurt. Fall off. Fall off, please, for the love of God, fall off. Why is he not falling off? There we go. Fall down, stab him, he's dead. Excellent. Now, this dog got stuck. What an asshole. <laughs> Wasted so much time because I thought that dog wasn't, uh, was gonna be a threat. Well, went better than expected. So yeah. Now you wanna come down here. Oh shit, I don't have any, I'm the, uh... Damn. Right. If you've got a bow, shoot that guy and kill him. He won't uh, aggro because he's part of a trap. He's part of this trap. No! I fucked that up. Stab him. Everything's cool. Now up here. 
we will have a, another shortcut, I believe. So you want to watch up here? You want to watch out for this guy. This is Sparta. He's not going to die, my god. What an asshole. Um, through here? Or is it further up? Yeah, it's through here. Ah. Yeah, it's just a female undead merchant. Um, you can't actually kill her, so it's fine. She doesn't sell a bow. Why the god? Why not? Damn it. So you could buy uh, moss off her. You could buy a lot of really useful things. You could buy purging stones. They're more expensive than Oswell Kareem, I believe, though. Uh, you could buy humanity here. It's nice. Uh, prism stones. Useful later on. Homewood bones. Uh, rotten pine. That's poison. Nice. Didn't even, I've never really looked at this person. She adds fire. Okay. You can buy blooming purple moss here. It's pretty pretty good. Uh, but we should be fine for now. Anyway, I'm gonna come over this way. Unlock this door. The notice down there there's the rat. That's this is the shortcut right next to Fire and Shrine. So that's pretty pretty good to have. Uh, I do need a bow. Oh, actually no, bolts should do. Bolts will do. I could do this with my crossbow. Let's um have you got bolts? You do. Um Wood bolts are fine. So don't need nine hundred of them. Uh, let's get like a hundred bolts. Okay. You can't go up here. That was it's broken. This doesn't lead to anywhere anyway. <coughs> this guy's back. He won't be li living for much longer. Even if he was technically not living in the first place. I don't know. Down here, we've got a uh, large soul that lost undead. It's pretty cool. And through here is to the depths. And we'll be doing that in the next part. So thanks for watching. I actually got done what I kind of wanted to do this episode. Huh. And I'll see you next time.